It's August. Welcome to day 46 of my 225 days of summer video series. You know the drill. While concentrating on raw vegan and vegan dishes, you'll discover these recipes will add variety and sass to all types of food. So, come join the fun. Remember, all recipes are from the Barbecue Lover's Big Book of Barbecue Sauces by Cheryl and Bill Jamison. These extraordinary recipes will continue to fill your summer of raw vegan fruits, vegetables, and more with a powerful flavor experience. You can find this book online or at your local bookstore. Today's recipe is black kale pesto. I love pesto, and this will be my first time attempting to make it at home. And I love kale, so this is a double treat. I'm so excited, guys. Let's get started. This recipe makes about two and a half cups. You'll need two cups chopped kale leaves, stems discarded, two garlic cloves, one cup walnuts, one cup ibu, three quarter cup parmigiano reggiano cheese, half a cup pecorino cheese, and salt to taste. Now for the healthier version. I used kale from my garden for this recipe. Unfortunately, heavy rains drown my plants, so this is a great way to say goodbye to it in my garden. Now, remember the smoked walnuts I made on day 36? I added one cup ground as the cheese. Also, I used half the amount of oil with sunflower oil. Let's continue. Add the kale, garlic, and walnuts to a food processor and blend until finely chopped. Then add the oil and cheese if you're using. Last, add salt to taste. Now this is so good. It's chunky and fragrant and lush on the tongue. This pesto will not last long. Use it the same way you use other pesto in veggie pasta or salad. Spread it on bread or crackers, even raw ones. Smear some on a tortilla before rolling your favorite vegetables. I'm eating this right out of the jar right now. Mm, enjoy and let me know what you think. See you tomorrow.